Britney Spears drops another bombshell about her ex, Justin Timberlake, alleging he cheated on her with another celebrity during their three-year relationship. In her new memoir, The Woman and Me, Spears says their high-profile romance wasn't what it seemed. CBS Mornings obtained the excerpt from the pop star's new memoir, The Woman in Me, out October 24th. Spears says she knew Timberlake had cheated on her, but decided to let it go. ET has reached out to Justin's rep for comment. You know what? We have fun. We love what we're doing. Yeah, I agree. You know, I mean, we're, we're you know, lucky individuals. You're not going to see us complaining. We're having a good time. Infidelity has long been rumored to be the reason the A-list couple split in 2002. And following the release of Justin's breakout solo hit, Cry Me a River, many speculated that it was Britney who was the cheater. As for the alleged other woman, Britney is keeping her identity under wraps, writing that the woman in question is now married with kids and she doesn't want to embarrass her. I feel like that's really important just to spread joy, you know, and be a happy person, a good person. But fans are speculating Brit could be referencing Nicole Appleton of the English girl group All Saints. Nicole was previously married to Oasis frontman Liam Gallagher, with whom she shares a 22-year-old son, Gene. And in 2021, she married Facebook exec Stephen Haynes. They share a three-year-old daughter, Skipper. But back in 2000, paparazzi snapped Justin and the singer ducking down in the backseat of a car, heading back to his hotel in London after a night out. ET has reached out to a rep for Nicole for comment. Years later, one of Britney's former makeup artists claimed Brit and JT had some issues after that, telling The Mirror in 2022, quote, she had her questions about who he was with because stuff would be out in the press. So he'd be out with some girl from All Saints and she'd get very jealous. You know, it's all about trust and he loves me and I love him and we just try to work it out. The latest allegation from Brit comes after another bombshell claim about her high-profile early 2000s relationship. According to an excerpt shared by People on Tuesday, Britney says she had an abortion after getting pregnant with Justin, claiming he didn't want to be a father. He said we weren't ready to have a baby in our lives, that we were way too young. It was a very difficult process, I think, for her to write this. When you do this, it is like reliving these experiences. Three years later, Britt started her family with then-husband Kevin Federline, with whom she welcomed two sons, Sean Preston and Jaden James. I love being a mom. As for Justin, he went on to marry Jessica Beale in 2012. You just have to keep making time for each other and you have to keep making each other a priority. They share two sons, eight-year-old Silas and three-year-old Phineas. I mean, it's wonderful to be parents and it's wonderful to give to your families and everything, but it's also important to be a person because if you're not happy, then your kids aren't happy and your husband isn't happy and your family isn't happy. It's not worth it. As headlines about Brit and JT's past relationship continue to swirl, a source told ET earlier this week, Justin's been focusing on his own family and trying not to concern himself with Britney's memoir. Justin has tried to be supportive of Britney from a distance. They dated so long ago, but he still has respect for her. The source adds that Justin and Jessica just want everyone to grow and evolve instead of continuing to bring up the past.